go. This is because behind closed doors. Now, for those of you who are non-smokers, you probably haven't been in this room, but there's a room in Parkfield House which people who want to go and have a smoke during the day can go and have one quietly, <laughs> just spend two or three minutes, have a smoke, go back to the work. Um, it tends to be a bit of a Morse code that sort of goes round, telephones ring, and before you know it, half the room have buggered off to the smoke room. So, um, this is a sketch on what actually happens in the smoke room. Behind closed doors. Phones are bloody bouncing today. <laughs> Seen that pile of complaints. Got to be out today. <laughs> Oh, I bet 
better go and check his parkies in his office. Oh, I don't blame that for all the crap. Oh, he's in luck to use the front stairs. <laughs> You're going to the toilet. No, you were supposed to go into the photocopy. Oh, no, I were No, no, no. No, Karen's going to the photocopy because I was going to the Michael film room at the same time. Hang on, hang on. We're going to have to get our act together here. We're going to get sussed out. Right, Maddie, right. you'll have to go into reception. Jill, you'll have to go into the photocopy. Hillary, Bax, and Joanne, toilet. I told him I've been to the toilet seven times already. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I've been to reception at least sixteen. But I'm so confused between the sax machine and the bloody toilet. I don't know what to do with the paper in the <laughs> Come on now, what are we going to do? Oh, bloody hell. Let's have another fight. 